I'd just like to talk about my um, 12 string build I did. Um, so this is an electric 12 string. It's my own design that's styled in the way a Dan Electro would be. As a 12 tuners. And the close up on the body. And it's some it's got some quite cool features I've put into it. It's got this kill switch to stop your feedback, which is actually a three-way tool switch, which I've wired as a two-way switch and um, kill switch. So to get rid of feedback, then there's obviously pickup selector, volume, and tone. And I'm actually put knocked on them yet, but the pops of it. And yeah, it sounds pretty nice, and there's um, it's pretty nice really overall. It's a nice colour. Used um, car paint and halberds and lacquer. Um, and perhaps surprisingly, all the electrics and everything all worked first time. So you have to undo it again. And it sounds pretty nice. Uh, yeah. Uh, there's some cool custom features I've added in, like, more like the kill switch, but also this, uh, I don't know if you can see, but this whole top you see is screwed on, so that makes it a lot easier to fix, so you can just whack the whole top off rather than fiddling with a pick guard or coming in from the back, it means you've got no nasty looking back plates on the back, and um, in my opinion it sounds just as good. Um, it's made actually of layered... Um, 12 mil plywood. So there's lots of layers of 12 mil plywood. I think it was three layers of 12 mil plywood, and then a five mil on the top and bottom. And yeah, it, it, despite being plywood, it sounds fine. But the thing is, I didn't make it a solid body. It's actually hollow here and here and here and there. So that's partly why it sounds better because it's semi-hollow body. Um, uh, yeah, so sounds pretty good considering all things. Um, a lot of people what, um, on forums and things said plywood wouldn't sound good, but I think because it's semi hollow wood body, it doesn't really make a difference. So, like I said, start with that the um, lipstick cover pickups, like a Dan Electro, and this is a pretty cool 12 string bridge. I think it's a goto one. So you have six strings going through the body. You have strict six strings going in through the back of the bridge, which makes a fairly good. Um, makes it not fiddly, and it's all fully adjustable. So every pair of strings is. Some of the not so good points are this paint can be a bit soft at times. It takes two weeks for the lacquer to dry completely. Um, also, it doesn't tune quite as well as I would like it to, it doesn't stay in tune, uh, but that's because I, I haven't wound these up completely, um, I haven't wound round them before I um, tuned it, which is partly why, but I mean I've only just put the strings on so it might get better, and um, yeah, the only other problem really is, if you look here, I don't think you'll be able to see, but the gap between this high E and the um, end edge of the neck is a really small one, so on this low E, it's really big, which gives it a uh, not so great um, playability, but other than that it's fine. So I made the body, I bought the neck, these are Wilkinson double locking tuners, so I think they help it, help it to stay in tune a bit. But I'm not really sure how effective they are. Okay, so I'll get on to some general sounds. I'm obviously going through this guitar, and then I'll go into the clean sound on a Vox VT30, so 30 watt amp, and I've got it mic'd up and coming straight into the computer. So this is what it sounds like. It's got that nice jangly 12 string sound, but then I can 
also make it a nice warm sound if I change the pickups to this neck pickup and scoop back on some of the volume, the tone, sorry, gives it a nice warm sound, which is nicer, I think, personally. So that, I think, riff I played before was... That's a lot of warmer sound, which is cool. And some other things about 12 strings generally is these two high E strings, they're exactly the same, unison strings, and the same for these. And then after that, you have your normal string, and you have a a string that's the same but the octave above so it gives you a kind of harmonic effect which is pretty cool and this neck is actually really short but with a 12 string when you only play chords really or I would anyway I didn't think that would be a problem because I'm not going to fiddle up here much they can do if you want to okay like that as well so all round I was quite happy with it now I'll show you some better pictures at the end and some pictures of um, some cool custom features like the strings uh, going all the way through the body on the back and a pretty cool custom neck plate I had made and sent over from America so that's over and out from me I'll be back soon hopefully